Hey Eurovox, I am Chris and here with the wonderful JL from Australia. First and foremost, I'd like to say a massive congratulations you. on your first two rehearsal performances. How do you think it went? I think it went really well and I'm really happy with everything that happened and I think like all the lights and like the film and everything is just amazing and it just looks, I, I, I feel like really alive on the stage and free. Have you managed to see any of your performances back from Minsk? Yes, I have. And are you happy with those performances? Yes, I'm really happy. Good. Yeah, I've like every time like I've just I kept I've keep I've kept improving. We've noticed that as well. You really have. Thank you. Um, a couple of days ago, you met the president of uh, Belarus. Yes. How did that go? How did you feel meeting him? Oh, it was amazing. Like we all even sang our group song for him, and he started to cry a little bit because oh. it was so beautiful. And he gave us a gift that was beautiful, and I will treasure it forever. And I just loved every moment of it. You've just said about treasuring this gift from the president of Belarus. What's been your best moment that you'll always treasure so far at the contest? Probably. Oh, I've taken, I've, I've taken a lot, there was this, in Euro Club, they've got like this photo booth and like we take like heaps of pictures and I took so many pictures with all my friends from all around the, the other countries and we all took so many pictures and I'll probably tre treasure those forever because I'll always remember that time when we all took pictures at Junior Eurovision having a great time. Oh. So have, you, have your Instagram followers gone up since you've uh, yes. been Junior Eurovision? Yeah, a yeah. lot. And are you popular now in school since you've um, decided to represent Australia? Kind of actually, and it, and it's more like a celebrity. It's like it feels like a celebrity because whenever I'll be walking around school, like people would whisper to their friends, "Oh my goodness, that's JL." Oh. And it's funny. Well, but you're the so star. Cute. You're the star in our eyes anyway. Definitely, we think you're going to do very well. I mean, Thank very you. well. You We've given both myself and Jessica goosebumps when we've listened to the song, oh, and we genuinely think you're going to do well. Um, thank you so much. A very kind of fun, quirky question now. Um, if you were a superhero, what would be your superpower and why? I would probably pick. That is a very good question. <laughs> a lot um, of people. A lot of people said fly. They would like to fly if they were yes, a superhero. Yes, I was so. thinking of doing that, but I want to do something unique. I want to do something like, you know what? I'm going to make up my own superpower. Mm, and it's going to be a superpower that whenever you touch a certain color, you just think of the food you want and it will appear right in front of you. Oh, that's a very good idea. That's a very good. <laughs> what is your favorite color, by the way? I love aqua. Oh, very interesting, a very nice colour. Yeah. And what makes you happy? What makes you smile? Um, there is certain movies, like on a rainy day and like a cold night, like with my mum and my dad like and my family, like if we're all of us like watching a movie in our lan lounge room, like it just makes me feel so happy and like, like just so warm and like it's raining and it's just because I love the rain and the cold and like if we're all watching a movie together, like there's like even this like category of like feel good movies or something oh. in on Netflix and we like to watch those and just like sit down and so which film do you watch a lot which is your favorite film um I love the greatest showman That's yes a really that nice is good movie. that is very good yeah. Hugh Jackman obviously yes. the fellow Aussie yeah. and one final question for you now I've got to ask this okay. this depends if you can be neutral or not which is your favorite song that you've heard being performed at that you oh. mean, other than your own other oh, than your own. Of course, yes. <laughs> um, I would probably have to say probably France, France because first of all she's so cute and she is very like she's really nice and like her song is very, you know, dancey and she's got a very amazing voice and yeah, she like another. She I've makes you smile. She does yes. make you smile when she sings. Yeah. And finally, would you like to say anything to your fans and the viewers of Eurovox? Well, thank you for all your support and make sure to vote for Australia. This Sunday, don't forget guys, this Sunday vote for Australia. Yes. She's certainly our champion. Good luck. Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you.